Welcome back. Thanks for staying tuned to Times Now. Well, we continue to get you more developments trickling in with regards to how anger is mounting against junior Stalin, Udayanidhi Stalin, over his anti-Sanatan remarks. In the latest, we're learning that 262 eminent citizens have written to the Supreme Court, a plea to take Suomoto cognizance of Stalin Jr.'s remarks, uh, asking that Udayanidhi Stalin's remarks must be branded as hate speech. It comprises of 14 judges, 130 bureaucrats, several other who have now written to the Supreme Court. Padmaja is joining us with more. Padmaja, the top court very recently, in the month of April, directed states to uh, sue motor register FIRs on hate speech incidents and proceed against offenders without waiting for someone to lodge a complaint. Uh, what is this letter that's been written to the CGI all about? It is in context of what the Supreme Court itself said in 2022 in the Shaheen Abdullah case, where they said that there cannot be any peaceful coincidence if there is the existence of hate speech and states should take so moto cognizance of any article of hate speech. It is in that context that now 262 citizens of India, including former judges, former bureaucrats, former uh, uh, veterans, have now written a letter saying that if the government of Tamil Nadu does not take so moto cognizance of what has been said against Sanatan Dharm, then that would be tantamount to contempt of court. Remember, this is in light of yesterday, two separate delegations, one in Delhi going to the resident commissioner of Tamil Nadu, submitting a uh, 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 submitting a memorandum saying that action should be taken and another where they had gone in Tamil Nadu to the governor demanding action. Back to you. Okay, many thanks for that, Padmaja. Let me quickly go across to Dharani as well. Dharani, all of these developments taking place and, uh, you know, uh, more and more anger really mounting against Udhanidhi Stalin. But as far as uh, the leader is concerned, the DMK Neta is concerned, he has come out with one clarification after the other. And in the latest, he says, I wasn't just referring to the Hindu dharam or Sanatan dharam. I was speaking about all religions. Udhanidhi is mentioning that he never, you know, uh, took the uh, names of Hindu, Hinduism, uh, you know, etc. Uh, during his speech. And his, his speech was entirely, entirely about Sanatan Dharma. And he was uh, uh, looking at Sanatan Dharma as an ideology and his, his critique... Uh, his critique is only about the ideology and it is not about uh, the Hindus and Hinduism is what he is telling and uh, you know even yesterday while talking to media at the uh, district of Tamil Nadu he went on to tell that uh, you know Sanatan Dharma is uh, you know uh, still needs to be eradicated and that it is again like you know dengue uh, malaria and corona so he is sticking uh, to his statement and he is repeating the state the uh, same statement again and again including you know yesterday yesterday night also he uh, reiterated the sta same statement and he told that uh, uh, you know the right wing political parties is uh, uh, you know, uh, their uh, attempts to twist this whole uh, scenario will not uh, scare him or rattle him and that he will uh, continue saying uh, uh, saying his opinion out, uh, out and loud again and again is what he has told. Okay.